heavy duty artillery here guys hey guys this is the alley where the stampede happened uh probably about a year ago now it doesn't feel like Greek korea it's one has come alive at night Heavy duty artillery here, guys. Tanks, planes, hummers, ships. It's pretty hot out here. So I'm gonna head in and maybe come back out here a little bit later. Got some missiles here. Fake, of course. That wouldn't be real. Can't Interesting uh, kind of graveyard of ex tanks and artillery gunners. I think these are underwater kind of missiles or something. Little plane. Pretty good. Very impressive. I'm going to go up the stairs. All right, I'll see you guys inside. came out of the war memorial very touching uh, tribute to all the forces that participated in fighting for the independence of uh, South Korea there's also a whole section in relation to the history of the Korean people and the dynasties that existed once upon a time very impressive I should say with the way they use their AI and uh, technology very very well uh, exhibited that's the Korea Seoul War Memorial obviously in Seoul it's free admission check it out need about two hours I'd say and you should be able to see the whole lot on to Itaewon There really is a surprise between or behind every road in, uh, in Seoul. This place is amazing. I've come to Itaewon. I feel like I'm in a, I'm in a movie set. Little streets, funky little cafes and bistros. Um, I'd say it will be quite busy at night time. It will totally, totally be a night destination. And I might have to come back tonight as well, but 
Look at this. Fantastic. Really nice. Right, I'll have a bit of a wonder. See what I can find. Hey guys. We're in into one. Very different vibe here. Very, very different vibe. Very kind of London maybe. Uh, Manhattan maybe. South Yarra, Melbourne maybe. Very different. Um, a lot more multicultural as well. There's heaps of different people here, different ethnicities. Um, it's just a kind of low level building, so all low rises. A few French bakeries as well. Uh, a lot of coffee shops. It's actually good, it's a good vibe. It's not too hot now, so I. I sat in the coffee shop for a while and came back out, did some editing, getting the next video ready. I don't mind it. It's good. It's different. It doesn't feel like Korea. You know, you've got the odd, um, odd Korean riding somewhere. Um, that's what, that's what makes it, um, that's what reminds you you're back in Korea, but all I can see is kebab shops and you know, Foot Locker and places like this, so... I don't know, it's different. I have to explore a bit more. Uh, now I really feel like I'm down Rodeo Drive or something. The vibe is... It's totally changed. It's it's becoming more hipster the more I walk down this street. It really doesn't resemble anything about Korea. At all. Crazy spaces. Look at this. The couches. Hey guys, this is the alley where the stampede happened uh, probably about a year ago now in uh, Itawan, Seoul, uh, to my left. Uh, the uh, tributes or what's left of them, uh, they seem like they're fading away now and there's not much of the tributes left. I think maybe the local council's moved on everything. Uh, it's, it's a bit of a sad alley, there's, it's all boarded up, there's not much going on here. Um, some guy grinding up there, they're doing a bit of work, so I'm not too sure what's happening. But um, I would have thought there'd still be a memorial here, but nah, it's all disappearing now. Um, but it's just, yeah, very kind of hard to kind of take in that so many people got, you know, passed away here. It's crazy. Um, 
the alley is quite narrow, pretty tight, and you can, you know, see how a, such a tragedy can happen. So this is where the stampede happened guys, down this alley. And these are what's left of the uh, of the messages that people were writing. <coughs> I'll go up and have a look. Quite sad actually. It all happened right here. I can't believe there were so many people jammed into a particular alley. This alley's very very narrow um, not a big alley seems pretty boarded up around here Radio guys, Ito on has come alive at night. It's a totally different place at night. All the lights are on. It's so busy.